So, Coach, obviously, just talking about a quick recap of the last tournament for you guys, going over to Southern Miss and uh, some really good uh, performances, and you mentioned about the toughness of the competition and some positive results that came from it. Oh, yeah, I thought that this Southern Miss was a good indicator of how well uh, we played against some good teams, and we have a group of players who can compete with the best. And um, I was proud of the way we played against South Alabama. That match was really, really close. Uh, Mots didn't play, um, but nor did their number one player play as well. So uh, as we get ready, uh, I think we're in a good place. And it was a chance as well. And you mentioned it also about how the conditions, and it was uh, obviously very unseasonably hot over there, so it took uh, quite a toll over the weekend. But uh, it's some really good performances. And, be and some guys, especially some of the younger guys, that beat some more experienced players from uh, some of those other squads. No doubt. I think you know, when you look at the success of a team, it's the depth, right? So we played well at 6, we played well at 5, we played well at 4. And those could be those matches that win a match for you. So. Um, I was pleased with the way we played. I was uh, pleased with the way we played against Southern Miss and uh, South Alabama. And, you know, it was just a good weekend for us. But now we have to carry it on. And, of course, you have the regionals coming up this week and starting on Thursday. And mm -hmm. we mentioned about competition. And you're certainly going to see a lot of competition from some of the big-time schools, especially around the southeast region. Yeah. Well, I think this is a group of players who can play with the best. This is the reason we're doing this. Um, I think the four players who are traveling this week are players who can compete with the best players from Auburn, Alabama, uh, you name it, they can play with them. They just have to be in the right mindset as far as competing goes, they have to execute, and if they do, they'll win. And I think that there is no variance in these matches, it's whoever shows up to play with the right mindset will prevail. And uh, I think we're in a good place, we just need to go out there with this mindset that we can you know, just because you're wearing an Alabama T-shirt or you're wearing an Auburn T-shirt means nothing. And um, I think we'll be ready to play. And you mentioned about, of course, four guys that are, that are going this week. Johannes is the one guy who was here the last go around when y'all went to the Southern Regionals a couple of years ago as a freshman. Obviously, just talking about his game and how he's developed uh, from that point and uh, until now. Oh, yeah. I mean, when you think when he first came to us as a freshman, he was basically a baseline player. He's developed into an all-court player with a, a stronger serve. But the best part of his game now is the volley. And he had success last year in doubles with Sam playing uh, in this position. So I think that Johannes is capable of playing at any position right now. He's playing that well. He's matured. Um, you see the difference from a, the freshman year and then the junior year. And um, I think he's capable of playing with some of the best players. And you'll have Mats, Misha, and Austin as well going along and just talk about your expectations overall from them. Well, you look at Mats. He had a win against Tulane last year. Uh, they were top 20 in the country. So Mats is capable of playing with, against anyone. When you look at uh, Misha, Misha, the biggest thing with Misha is conditioning. The, the fitness factor is a little bit of my concern with him. Other than that, he is just as good as anyone in the straw. He's that talented. You have to go back and think of him. At one time, he was the number one junior in Russia and um, he is blessed with some great hands and then Austin Austin has this game that is somewhat unique in its way now he's a big servant volleyer and if his mindset is good and he's there playing his playing his game to his advantage he'll win thanks coach thanks